Alright guys, in today's video I'm going to be playing some Lugia. I just want to get a feel for how it runs because I'm considering running it at NAIC. And also, um, I went to my first Pokemon pre-release today and it was, uh, it was an absolute blast. I was like one card away from going undefeated. The energy I needed in the last round was uh, one more card deep and it was still a lot of fun. And I pulled the uh, Cyclone out of my packs and I was super happy about that. And then um, I was feeling pretty good and he had some packs left over and I ended up buying four of them. And in those four packs, I got the uh, legacy energy. So uh, basically I got 10 packs total from the pre-release and or was it, I can't remember if we got six initially and then three, or if we got nine initially and then three. So it was either 10 packs or 12, I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, I got two Ace specs and two good ones at that. And then um, I pulled the uh, Full Art uh, Torkoal and uh, Hollow Monkey Dory for the Gardevoir. And I've been testing Gardevoir like crazy. So that was pretty cool. And then I got a Full Art uh, Trainer card, my first Full Art Trainer card. So um, yeah, these are my uh, first two uh, Full Arts that I pulled in person. Um, don't think either one of them are particularly good, but um, I will definitely take that along with the two A specs. So. The only thing I could have wished for is um, unfair stamp and the uh, like the spec aroma, you know, the ones that like Gardevoir use, right? But uh, yeah, all in all, it was um, really fun, and uh, I kind of make my I made my money back in Pokemon and then some, which is kind of unusual. So uh, I'll take that. But uh, yeah, with that being said, um, you know, I don't know if I've ever played this deck. I don't think I've ever played it, maybe one time, but I don't think so because it wasn't in the client and I just imported this list. Um, but my friends who's been coming over and testing, we've been proxying the uh, next set and attaching the new energy to Iron Hands just seems so broken and it's so powerful against Gardevoir. It just feels like I lose whenever he gets it off. So I really wanted to uh, put in some work with this. Um, little worried about um, electric decks if I did take this, but you know, every deck has some bad matchups, right? So let's just uh, see how it goes. I'm going to misplay a bunch. I'm sure I am because I haven't played it before, but um, you know, I need to keep learning before NAIC. <coughs> Pardon me. Their name is Boy Knight. That is uh, very cringe. <coughs> Okay, I'm assuming I want to go sec <clears throat> second with Lugia anyway. <clears throat> For uh, this exact reason. I don't know why Snorlax is in here. I, I don't know if it's literally just to have this other um, attack available. I, I, I don't get it. Doesn't seem that great. I guess it's just a single prizer that can deal 180. I, I don't know. Yeah, I'm about to research this hand away. So, after I Ultra Ball, or at least one Archaeops, right? Seems seems decent. Can attach one Turbo Energy here as well. Now, if they went second, they'd be able to 110 this twice, probably, if I didn't evolve. <clears throat> Do, do. Yeah, that's one thing about Pokemon that's kind of weird is you can like take a nap during your opponent's turn. I'm, I'm honestly really looking forward to Pokemon Pocket. If it if it's good and the games are actually faster, that would be great because this this is this is a switch <coughs> or attach. Another come bit back. <laughs> they put a Colrus in the Lost Zone. That makes me lost. Uh, this is useless. Um, I hope I don't need another one of those. I don't know if I need if I need a Snorlax, I'm in big trouble. 
Okay, let's grab an Archaeops. Let's just do one of these. Let's, um... I think we can just research. That's what I wanted. Get the little baby. Um, I drew four supporters. Because, you know, why not? Okay, well. I might Luminion for an Arvin for an Ultra Ball to get rid of this Archaeops. And then I might actually be able to do the thing. That'd be a great thing. Yeah, this version of Lugia seems underwhelming, but the new version seems crazy. I like it because it's, it's, you know, it's toolboxy. Please just get a psychic off the board so the board will stop going whoop, 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 whoop. <laughs> Please. <coughs> and something went down the wrong pipe, and now I won't stop coughing, man. You still need a Giratina. You do still need that. I might just evolve and dump this whole hand. I don't know. Iono is so good against them, though. Probably won't do that. Uh, I really want to dump this though. Bro. Void Knight is taking forever. Hey, there's a Gunatina. Alright guys, you you awake from your nap yet? One ten. That's my big turn finish. One ten. Are you getting rid of that? Are you getting a seven? You are getting a seven. That's crazy, bro. Well now you can't retreat unless you have a do that. Okay, that, that 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 is the plan. Okay, 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 okay. If I research now, though, I'm probably gonna draw like all my energy. Um, don't really want a Luminion, but, uh, I think I have to. Yeah, I would like to use the effect. That'd be good. Let me make sure I have another Ultra Ball on my deck. I do. Arvin, Ultra Ball, useless thing. Oh, it puts it back to, oh no, it puts it back to 210. All right, so we can go here. Um, I think we get rid of research now. I think we get rid of this.
Okay. Now, I can only do 210. So I can't kill that. Don't have a way of getting it out even if I could. So since that's true, I think we do this and get... I think we have to go down on the prize race, unfortunately. And then I think we go Mist and Gift on my next attacker, like this. That way there's no Radiant Greninja nonsense. And then we can hit this. I mean, I, I guess if I lose this, I'm just dead anyway. So 180. Okay. I guess this is good for wrecking other Giratinas, right? Don't really know. First game ever with it. Do, do, do. Yeah. Keep on taking forever. Seems good. Okay, so they must be planning to evolve it this turn. I don't know why. I guess because they um, don't want to just shred and leave it vulnerable to be easily more easily killed, I guess. Don't really know. Okay, so they have one of each Giratina. Oh, okay, so they're going to steal the energy away, swap in. That's 220. They gonna put a water on Greninja? Okay, I'm confused. Uh, they got two energy in here. I think I want to Iono them because my hand's not that great, right? Right now. How am I doing 270? Or, oh, it's 7, 14, 21. Wow, it really gets up there fast, doesn't it? Okay, well then let's do... I don't think Vitality Ban crosses anything meaningful. So let's set up some more hackers. Uh... Oh, from my hand. Okay, okay, good. Not mad at it. Oh, it's 210. That was almost embarrassing. I 
probably supposed to hold the Iono until I draw a bunch of my energy, but I have so many represented already. I mean, I'm already seeing eight... 12. There's only four left in the whole deck, so... And Thornton recycles my dudes, right? Nice. Actually pretty sick. Were there no bosses in this deck? That seems kind of whack. If they keep leaving these little nothings up there, then I'm gonna just um, attack them with like an Archaeops after I have an attacker in the back. Yeah, get out of here. I'll take it. That was not the most exhilarating gameplay. Um, it felt kind of... Um, what's the word? Uh, it's not just linear. It's like... Um, maybe brain dead? Maybe that's the word? Like, I, I'm sure I misplayed. It just seems like... That's, that's why I'm considering for NAIC, though, is because... Um, it should just have like really nice, easy things to do. Alright, so I, I Aroma first. If I find Archaeops, then I have uh, Pood for Ultra Ball. If I find the basic for uh, for this guy, then that's great too. I already have like almost everything I need, so that's kind of sick actually. And this could, oh no, actually, if, if it gives me an evolution, then um, I can get the uh, an Archaeops, so... Oh, that's what I just said. Roaring Mooney X. That's actually kind of scary. I'm not gonna lie. Give me something. Eh. Oh, put it into my hand? Oh, that's kind of sick nasty. So then I could get Arvin, yeah? Okay, that kind of helps with that. I would like to use Luminia Sign. Okay, if I get Arvin, then... Because I already have the Lugia in my hand and one Ultra Ball. I can search for an, for an Ultra Ball. Find at least one Archaeops. Is that, like, a, a terrible? No, 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 because now I can find both Archaeops. So... Give me Arvin. Now I can Arvin. I want it guaranteed. It's actually not useless in this matchup. Then I can Ultra Ball. I don't think I need this anymore. And... Uh, Mueyak seems really cracked. No, I need the energy for the Lugia. I don't think I need the maximum belt. I can use that to discard this Archaeops. No, to discard the second Archaeops. So this I don't want to give up the Mew EX. Maybe I just don't need it. Like 
Like, this all seems reasonable, right? Like, as long as he doesn't knock this out right now, I'm okay. If he does, I guess I'm in a little bit of trouble, though. Oh, no. Uh-oh. He must be able to do it. Oh, no. At least there's, there's no energy in here right now. Spoke too soon. No. Oh, now he's got the patch, man. Does he not have patch? He does. You're just teasing me, right? Yeah. What? Why did he not knock the loogie out? This is insane. Oh, because it's to bench Pokemon. <laughs> That's why. Uh, get wrecked. Uh, get bodied. Why don't you work? Oh, okay. It just wasn't doing the, like, the dancing and such. Um, his retreat cost is two. I could attach for the retreat cost, but I would need to do seven, 14, 21. That's 27. So I would not kill that in return. Huh. So maybe just these two. I already had a gift on there, darn it. They all look the same. Oh no, with the attachment from hand, I could have knocked it out. Oh my goodness. I am stupid. Yeah, 7, 14, 21. Oh no. If I would have just Archaeops both this and retreated, then I'd be fine here. Oh, but he can't one-shot me back though anyway, because then he knocks himself out. So this might actually be okay. Okay, there are boss's orders in here. That's good. Okay, so that's good. It probably won't be able to one-shot me anyway. Uh, yeah. It'll stop them from getting the, the done. The dirt dirt dirt. But yeah, I could have just double Archaeops and attached from hand, and that would have been enough. I just would have retreated, knocked that out, then they'd just be taking a single prizer. But, I mean, if he wants to use the effect and knock us both out, then I'm just gonna... Yeah, that is what he's doing. Oh, wait, I didn't put the Mist Energy on there. Wait, Mist Energy would have protected me from that. Oh, my goodness. Oh, there's, there's a Mist. Not that that matters. Um, if he sends out one that he doesn't want to... Um go up, then I'm just gonna boss the other one. Yeah, I'm just gonna boss the other one. That was so bad. Holy crap.
Like, now I need an Iono, right? Yeah, that can knock out anything now, so... I think we're I think we might be we might be okay anyway, but man, a mist energy would have just solved all my problems there. It's like the point of mist energy. Holy crap. If they try and load up the one in the back again, I'm gonna boss that one again. And just bully him. Just gonna bully him. Yeah, whichever one you load up. I mean, I'm assuming Sada is coming. Like, you can only attach so many energies per turn. Yeah, so that one's getting bossed, because he's almost definitely going to attach to that one as well. Yeah, there's the Sada. So... He Dark Patch, he hasn't attached for turn yet. That's kind of crazy. So he Dark Patches Sada's then plays that yeah that sucks does he not have the energy in hand what he has to he has to yeah okay and he's gonna pitch one for um concealed cards right because he can't help himself. Just looks at Archaeops and Lugia don't have enough attack power, really. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That missed energy in this game was oh, it was one. I'm so stupid. Uh huh. Uh huh. Okay, so it's doing 180. Is this only on 190 because of double turbo? Yeah, that is how that works. Okay. Wait a minute. I don't know why that one's not showing itself, but whatever. The little baby. Man, I'd have a whole nother attacker, man, if I put the Miss Energy on. Good lord. There's no way they're going to put down a two-prizer. There's no way. They're just going to hope that I can't keep making dudes, which is a really strong possibility. But they, may not, they might not be able to either. Yeah, you got one more energy in hand. Hopefully that wasn't a supporter, because that's what they need. They already had the supporter. 
Okay, three to this thing is a huge investment. Okay. So they're going to knock this out. How did this Archaeops end up with an energy on it? That's what I want to know. Okay. How many energy are 11? Protect it from nonsense. I have got no special energy left. That is not good. Um, yeah, so I think I'm just dead if he kills this then. Do I Iono and put him on two so the likelihood that he can get out of this is really low? I think so. I can boss one of those up with the Archaeops. So maybe one of these is an energy? No. Okay. Well, if you can knock this out, I'm dead. And do I want to even count this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13. 14, 15, 16, 17. Uh, so that's not enough. None of those, so that's 18. That's not one either. That is not one either. Can you stop? He's still not there. Oh, USOB. Lost to freaking counter catcher. Well, I really lost to not attaching Miss Energy. That's what I lost to. Oh, I can't wait till they get rid of this these obnoxious um emotes. Okay, so. I'm just insane for not attaching Miss Energy. Should have won that one probably pretty handily if I did. But hopefully you enjoyed the video. Thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you tomorrow. Mm -hmm.